So I also have two book reviews. I read The Miraculous Journey of Edward Tulane and Five Children and It. So I liked both of these books, but I think I liked The Miraculous Journey of Edward Tulane better just because it had like interesting turns and like it was emotional. I really like emotional books because I don't know. If, if I'm not emotionally invested, then I'm not going to want to read it again, I guess. So, I guess I liked that. But, I didn't really... The weirdest part of that was, like, how a lot of years went by, but to him it didn't really seem that long because he wasn't, like, a real rabbit. And so... It was it was cool how they wrote this book, like how he was in the ocean for like like a year or something. That was cool, and he just I don't know I don't know how can he just decide to stop thinking? Because I think I definitely would have if I was him, and. I didn't understand how, like, people, he would get mad when people would call him, like, an inanimate object, but then, like, he can't move or anything, so it's like, you are an inanimate object. So, that didn't make any sense. And this whole time I was thinking that he was going to become, like, a real rabbit. Kind of like in the Velveteen Rabbit. But, it was just cool how he got back to his original owner and he I don't know that was really awesome but it was really sad with the girl in the middle so I was really glad I read this book later in night because my eyes were already like dry and hurting kind of from like staying up too late and so it didn't I, I didn't cry I would have probably otherwise so I also read the um, Five Children in It. And I like this book because it was like little short stories almost. Like it was like each day and they weren't really interconnected. They kind of were, but you could probably read these each little chapter like on the part and you it wouldn't really matter if you completely forgot what would happened already. So I like that about this. It was, it was cute. My favorite day was when the one boy became a giant. And they used him to get money. That was funny. But, I don't know. I looked up and there's like sequels. I think it's a trilogy or something. And because of that, I... Like, this. the next one is like... They go to their uncle's house because it's like... World War One or two or something. So I had a dream. I think it, I think they said World War Two or something. And I had a dream about World War Two, and I was a girl from Poland, so in like a camp. So that was really weird because I only just quick glanced at World War Two, and then I dreamt about it that night. So that was weird, but. So I think I'm going to give The Miraculous Journey of Edward Tulane a 10 because I like, I definitely like to read it again because of how emotional it was. And I think I'll give The Five Children in it maybe like an 8. Like it was cute and I would definitely want to read it to my children if I ever have children but otherwise I, don't know, it was, I like these ones, these look cute so that's all I have, see you next time